Have you ever opened your closet and assessed everything that was inside of it? And then you got overwhelmed because the first and most overwhelming thought in your mind was, I can't find anything to wear. Today, I'm going to give you a tip to help you overcome that because in many instances, it's a lie. My name is Armand Wake Up. This is Model Ministry. Now, look, I feel you. I get it. You know, you could have mountains of clothes or you could only have, you know, basic essentials. But some days you don't know what you want to wear. And sometimes you get overwhelmed because you're trying to imagine the whole outfit. And that can be overwhelming, stressful, and make you not want to get dressed at all. You just throw something on and just be done with it for the day. But then you're you're not confident because it's not really what you want to wear. But this is how you solve that puzzle. The first tip is to find something in your closet that you want to wear. Usually there's one thing that in your mind when you open your closet, that's where you want to go to. A pair of pants, a t-shirt, uh, some sneakers, even some socks, uh, accessories. One thing. That's all you need. One thing to focus on. Because the reason you're overwhelmed is that you're trying to imagine the whole outfit. But what eliminates that frustration is to piece it out and focus on one success. So that one success is, this is what I want to wear. I want to wear this denim jacket. I want to wear this t-shirt and go from there. That one thing is going to connect all of the other things to make up your entire outfit. Another thing to consider is, what are you doing that day? Well, this is something that I talk about with a lot of my friends and our biggest thing is comfort. I want to be comfortable. Sometimes you just want to get it off. This is more so, this seems to be more of a thing with women. You hear the expression, beauty is pain. So sometimes women are going to wear uh, those heels or those shoes that may give them some discomfort, some pain, but they like the way they look in that particular item of clothing. Sometimes guys will do that. We might wear something that's a little too tight. You know, sometimes you, the biggest size they have in, in the shoe is maybe a half size too small or a full size too small. You'll take the insole out, however that goes. But what is your primary concern for the day? Are you trying to be comfortable? Are you trying to be cute? Are you trying to present yourself in a certain way? That will determine everything else that comes from the decisions that you make with the items of clothes that you pick. You may be going on a job interview. You may be running errands. You may be kicking it that day. You may be going out on a date. All of those things factor into like what you're wearing and it's important. Now, my last tip is if you don't know what you want to wear out the gate, think of something that you like the way that you looked in, you like the way that it felt and go with that. Start there. It was a flannel. It was uh, some shorts. It was a hoodie. You liked the way that it looked on you. You liked the boost of confidence that it gave you. So start there. Maybe just wear it differently. Um, that's why it's important for you to have lots of essentials and basics. You definitely need a denim jacket. You definitely need some sweatpants. You definitely need a hoodie. Things that will match with multiple pieces in your closet is essential because it's very likely that that one thing you want to wear is going to be the centerpiece of your outfit. You know, you don't want you don't want to look like a mannequin, but it's OK to have pieces in your outfit that people are drawn to. So I really, really, really hope that this helps you guys out. If it doesn't, let me know if it does. Let me know and we'll figure it out. But that helps me a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton. My name is Armand Wake Up and this is Model Ministry.